Rage on that beat, going crazy. So we are here at the hospital, guys. Prayer hands for Aaliyah. Um, she was just in class and suddenly she started to not feel well. She had a very, very bad headache, blurry vision. She's vomited three times within the last 10 minutes. Yeah, so she feels very weak right now. So we're just waiting on the doctor to come in and um, hopefully everything is okay with her. All right, y'all, so currently they say she's dehydrated. Um, she has a migraine and a sinus infection. She's refusing an IV, so I'm trying to talk her into getting her IV because that's the only way she's gonna get better at this point. I'll keep you posted. Kind of desensitize it. Okay. Make a fist for me one more time. Make a fist. You're doing great. Okay. Ready? No, don't move. Ready? The needle's already out. Just look. It shouldn't hurt. It, it's a little steep. That's normal. Okay, you're doing normal. great. Okay, ready? Now, just stay right there. We're going to put this tape on it to make sure that we're going anywhere so we don't have to don't do look, this awful thing again. Okay? The needle's already out. The needle is out. Yes, it's out. Okay. Needle's gone. Good job. Good. Okay, so now we give you medicines. Now this medicine is gonna help you a lot faster because it goes right into your bloodstream. All right. Yeah. Taking a deep breath. Are you okay? Yeah. Okay, so Aaliyah just got her first IV. The nurse that did it was awesome, right? Yeah, he was really nice. He explained Hot everything to her and she got through it perfectly done she took they had to give her three medicines so we're gonna let them kick in and we'll tune back in all right y'all so we finished Leah is feeling much better thank goodness thank the lord Leah, how you feeling better yeah i'm gonna take these off now Ooh, I had to wear that mask for a while, but had to stay safe, of course, in the hospital. What do you feel about the first time um, experience of getting your IV? Um, the doctor made it much easier. The way he explained it made it so much like easier to get done. Mm -hmm. When they took it off, the tape honestly hurt more than taking the straw out. Yeah, and they explained it to you. We just got in a truck. They explained the nurse. He did amazing. Yeah. Um. He explained to her step by step. He even brought an extra needle to show like yeah how it, it works. How it works. And a lot of people. Um. I was trying to read her information online. One out of four people are terrified and scared of needles. So the best way to work it work with it. Um, for both the patient and the provider is to let them know, you know, you're scared and then they work it out together And there's multiple things like you yeah. can try to distract yourself. You can hold on to the bar of the bed You can hold yeah, on to your parent. ideas. Yeah, and then also a big misconception of IVs is that the actual needle People think the actual needle is stuck in them and yeah. I ain't gonna lie. I have five kids not only did I have to get IVs, obviously, for all five times, but there's been multiple visits. I suffer from migraines. I've had to come multiple times to the hospital for asthma attacks, for migraines. I've gotten several, several, several IVs. And I used to think, too, like, I'm not scared of shots at all, needles at all. She isn't. It's kind of weird. <laughs> I'm, I'm like... Shots are just a phobia to me. So. Yeah. It, and for me, like, I'm just like, okay, give me whatever I need. Like, I'm not scared of it. But I used to kind of think need the needle stuck in your your skin. Like, the straw is just like, it doesn't even hurt. It feels like nothing. It just feels like 
nothing on your skin. It's just like, and it bends really easily. So yeah. So, so the needle, you don't. It doesn't go all the way in, even though it's like this long. Mm -hmm. It doesn't go all the way in. It just goes in. Like you have your blood has to go in. Like, yeah. Out the tube. Then like, as long as there's blood in it, then they could start. They take it out and then put the tube. It's like push it. Yep. And it's more like a like a very soft yeah tube that stays in. It's like soft, squishy. Honestly, shots hurt more than the thinking than the IV because it, it like it goes in. They go like they <laughs> with that it just goes like that, so it didn't really hurt. I I mean I personally even learned something new today. Like I said, I wasn't sure if the needle stuck in there, but it makes sense for people to think the needle stays in mm -hmm. on your IV. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so it wasn't as painful. We talked it through with her. Uh, the nurse did, like we said, amazing, amazing. And now you're saying it was kind of fun? Mm-hmm. That was my first time getting this. Honestly, it like feels like nothing when it goes in because it's going in your vein. Yeah. So I'm like, so how this and it's all fast. and it is fast it's in your vein and your blood the blood goes into it faster so you don't have to just sit there and wait yeah because that was the thing she refused the iv at first and i was like oh no you're getting the iv and i mean she's 12 so of course they're going to listen to her concerns too and she was scared so they're like okay you know what We'll go ahead and give you some medication. We'll give you a, a pill that's going to, like, take the nausea away. Because she kept throwing up. And yeah. they did that, and she threw that up. So like, they were, it's like... the tiniest, thinnest... Like, I could swallow pills. I, I even could swallow, like, big ones. So. Yeah. And that one dissolved under your tongue, right? Yeah, but then it tastes funny. But then it tastes good because it was, like, candy, too. Yeah, tastes... so they made a deal. Made a deal, yep. Her and the you doctor. You up, you're taking the thing. The IV. But he said it funny, so. <laughs> yeah, it he said like it that. funny. And the, the crazy and thing is. And they were all laughing. We were all laughing. The doctor that was on staff today, he was actually the doctor. I've seen him a few times here in the emergency yeah. room. Um, a couple times for migraines. And then the one most memorable time was me and Aaliyah were exposed to something. And we had to come to the ER. I was like feeling faint, nauseous, everything. Like I didn't know what was going on. So, and we had um, to get on oxygen too for the exposure that we got. And this yeah, was a couple years ago. But anyways, Not we two. came here. Yes, two years ago. We came here and I remember my mom and my dad were in the mm. ER room with me. Yeah. She was in there because we were like co-patients. Yeah. And then um, A-Train and his mom were outside with the kids. And he was like, you know, coming in to check on us and then going back out. But he had switched with my parents. And the, do the doctor comes in and was like, okay, we did all testing and blood work and everything. Um, and by the way, you're pregnant. And I was like, what? And then Papa was like, I'm, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine? Her dad was there. Yes, my and mom and my, my dad were in like, the room. I was like, baby number five. Mm -hmm. So that was Miss Faith. And the nurse, he, or not the nurse, I mean the doctor, he brought it up again. He was like, I, I remember you too. Like, I've seen you a couple times meeting me, but he's like, I remember her as well. <laughs> And I was like, yes, you're the one who told me I was pregnant. And lo and behold, she's two years old now. So... Yes, it was definitely a great visit um, under yeah. some, you know, not the best circumstances. What started all this, Aaliyah, that we had to come? So, like, my vision. Mm-hmm. Like, my eyes are really, like, sensitive. It's weird. So, her eyes, like, she was in online school, and I was in my yeah. room. She came in there, and she was crying. She said, something is not right. Something's wrong with me. I feel like, like I'm going to pass out. I yeah. can't see out of my left eye. The other eyes kind of... Blurry. blurry and I was like I know these are like symptoms of like maybe high blood pressure but she doesn't have high blood pressure so the I was, lady said my for my age I did have high blood pressure yeah but it went down she said it wasn't too high but it was high for her age and 
pain was a big factor of that. Yeah. So if you are in a lot of pain, your blood pressure automatically goes up. So and then she started throwing up like a lot. a lot three times before we could get here, like within a ten minute spam. Um, and three she, times. what else? Oh, you had a very, very bad headache. Very bad. So I was like, you know what? We have to rush her to the hospital. Like, I don't know what's going on. I felt on. like if I think if I didn't come here, I would probably. No, it, the pain would be so bad because it just gets worse if you don't do nothing. Yeah. So we get here. They immediate. Well, she threw up again when we got here. And yeah. then they immediately took her back. Um, and they said maybe it's a sinus infection. And they ran tests and everything. And turned out it was a very bad migraine so my first migraine her first migraine so now we're going to definitely be checking up with her pediatrician to make sure everything's okay i, think I should be eating healthier we're definitely going to be eating healthier she does have store. yeah she's been saying she wants to get some just fruits and veggie diet, diet. for a while yeah i can eat fruits all day guys it's like water <laughs> she wants to try new things. Did get a prescription. We're not going to show that because it yeah. has our information on there. But yeah, she has her discharge yeah, paper and <laughs> prescriptions on there. We're going to follow up with her pediatrician and if need be, because I don't know if uh, migraines are hereditary. I'm not sure. I'm going to have to do some research on that. But if so, then we'll look into look going into seeing a neurologist as well and make sure everything's okay so one thing we would like to say y'all is thank you so much for all the prayers for Aaliyah and thank you for joining the Elliot family, family of seven plus, plus the fire, fire squad. squad make sure you like share comment and subscribe because why because you're coming with the fire content every single day stay blessed and highly favored peace, peace.